Hi, this is Jennifer, and my assistants today are Nora and Lodi. I'm going to make the next page of my seven journals that I'm making for Christmas presents. So, here we go. I went to the computer, and I cut off the notebook ends, and then I printed up several different rose pictures and I went to the sewing machine and I set a zigzag stitch down the edge um, if it didn't have a lot of edge on this side I put it on the other side and then I'm going to glue so I'm going to get out my glue oh, wait there regular old Cool glues that I'm going to be using. And here we go. Alright. And I'll cut off those strings in a minute. So don't worry. I might just cut them off at the end of my project. I'm going to be adding in like some more pockets and cards, tags, and all that kind of stuff at the end. Words. I just want to get it together at this point. I think the more um, progress you see it and coming together quickly the more fun it is. So I'd like to do it that way. And there we go. We just got to let that dry. And it looks like it's been sewn into the book. Because it's very hard to sew into a book that already exists. I do it this way. I learned it from another YouTuber. I'm going to start trying to write down the YouTuber's names that I find creative um, things that I use and that way I can mention them because I have a really bad memory okay let's go on to the next book if you want to know how I did this one you'll have to look at the previous video that I made today here's the next one good My son is homeschooling over here. Might show you him. His name is Zebedee. All depends on whether he's being distracted by mom or doing his work. <laughs> okay, that one's in. Set it aside. Go to the next one. Now, I don't even know if I can see comments if they come up. I doubt they will come up because nobody knows I'm going live. But I just thought I would do it live today. Just to see what that was like. I don't really know how to do anything. I just do it. Not the best at all the newest things. I just know I'd like to have somebody telling me how to do little things. Like this. So I put them on my so people can learn now I noticed that this one has words on it so I guess it wasn't a free image I'm not sure but I'm not selling these books anyway so it's not going to make any difference they're a giveaway Yeah, this is my upside down book. It really bothers me. Hopefully it won't bother the person that I give it to. Because it, most of it's going to be covered up anyway. And 
and it will not look upside down once it's all covered up. I'll show you the other pages. So it doesn't look upside down when you're looking at it right here or here. So some of the pages you can tell it's upside down. But that's okay. I didn't want to chunk the whole thing. Waste not want not. Okay, next book. Okay, flipped. Now I'm wondering, should I keep this page or not? It has camels in it. It's pretty cool. I guess it's the desert. An oasis in the desert or something. It's kind of weird. There's camels, lots of trees, and sand. So it must be a desert region. There we go. If I keep it, I'll probably sparkle it up so it'll be more interesting. I'll sparkle it up with my my uh, pixie dust. <laughs> That's what I call it. Makeup. If you want to see a tutorial on that, you'll have to look back over my playlist. Next book. Let's see if he's doing his work. <laughs> okay, next book. Because it won't cover everything I left out some things that didn't really didn't matter on the words so it weren't bad or something that I didn't want showing and I left them I might end up putting some lace or something at the bottom to cover that too we will see on the final touches at the end of the project. <laughs> okay, next book. You can see where I cut out stuff. I don't like that. Maybe I can get that disguised. I think I like this one better. So I'm going to go with this one. This book's upside down too. I think that's what my other assistant was trying to tell me over here. Ooh, somebody was trying to get in my door. Now, maybe I can slip that over those little edges of book page or inside of them or something. Them a bit. Now this goes out over the page so I'm going to cut some of that off. This is a tinier book. Cute little pink book. Pretty good. I'm not the best cutter. But I try. Alright. I think that's all of them. And you can do this too. You just take your little pages. That is if you have the kind of printer I have. And I'll show you what I have. I have a brother. It's a monochrome brother. I'll have to excuse all the mess in my room. Anyway, it pulls out and you can adjust right here and here. So you can put smaller pages in. And that's what I do. Thanks for watching. Have a great Friday.